Hi, welcome to week two. I just wanted to give you a, a brief introduction to some of those things that I'm looking for uh, as we move toward the end of this first module. This first assignment is about creating a wiki page and it's called Rocks, an overview. Uh, when this first assignment and this wiki page is complete, you should have a resource that you can refer back to uh, if you need more information or a refresher on metamorphic rocks or igneous rocks or sedimentary rocks, this kind of thing. Uh, in order to make this rock overview, it's going to be your job to write the content and upload graphics into the wiki page. Uh, the instructions for who's going to work on what are found in the M1 wiki entry instructions page. Uh, and you'll see how points are earned and what I'm looking for. Please take some time to look at that and please also notice that I'm looking for you to edit uh, and make suggestions for what your peers are working on. So let's take a look at how this works. So here we are at a wiki page that was created by a group of students in a previous class, a previous semester, uh, and you can see that there's a lot of information here. The topic is ISO 50001. That's not important for us to understand what that is unless of course you take ENY 160. And then each section was broken down for a student to work on, and uh, some incorporated graphics, some didn't. If you look at the scoring guide, you will see that at least one good picture uh, is necessary for full marks for your uh, section, for your assigned section. So this section right here, this student did not receive full marks because there is no graphic here. The information is very well laid out and it's very informative. Unfortunately, it didn't include everything that I was looking for. This student chose to align all of their pictures to the left. That's fine. This student centered their picture. They got a little creative. This looks pretty good. This is very similar to what you might find on a Wikipedia page. So let's actually go ahead and edit this page and see if we can spruce it up even a little bit more. In the upper right corner, I'm going to click this edit button. And then if I click on this picture, I have to maybe get the cursor next to the picture and then click on the picture. I can change the alignment. So let's move that to the right. Notice what it did to all of that text. That's OK, because we're just going to clean this up a little bit. So let me get my cursor just to the right of this graphic. I'm going to left click on the graphic. I'm going to hit the uh, align to the right uh, option. And we see that some interesting things have happened here. This is OK. Probably what has happened is that the corner, the anchor of this text, uh, the anchor of this graphic and the anchor of this graphic is tied to some word uh, in this paragraph. And so we're going to see if we can't clean it up just a little bit. If I you see here, I've got this cursor in between the two lines. Uh, if I move this graphic so that I get a cursor at the end of the word once, there's this line, it's, it's next to the word once, now it's next to implementation. Let me move it next to costs. Look at that, I've just changed where the picture goes. The problem is it's now spilling into the next section. So maybe what we should do is get the cursor uh, we should probably shrink this picture just a little bit and maybe even shrink this picture just a little. Boy, it's kind of hard sometimes to find that anchor, you know. So let's we'll just make this a little bit smaller. And then what we can do is maybe insert a little bit of space here. And now we're getting somewhere. This looks pretty good, right? If I were to make this picture just a little bit bigger. See, it's kind of tricky, right? That's okay, though, because uh, we're still figuring this out. If I make this just a little bit bigger, oh, yeah. Whoa, whoa! Probably didn't need it that big. Let's control Z to undo. Well, control Z doesn't work. What if I do this? So I'm not entirely sure what I did. Somehow I made it, uh, I wonder if I accidentally clicked uh, to make the image the original size. So down here, I have this uh, box, which will help me with alignment, right, and so on. It looks like I did the original size. So we're going to click, I'm going to click the minus symbol here to make it smaller. But you can see that I had also grabbed this upper right corner and made it much smaller, much faster. So let's do something like, 
this looks pretty good. And then if I can get this image, it's a little bit tricky. Uh, I want to move it to the end of costs. And maybe that's all I'm going to get. If I can just go a little bit bigger and then go up a little bit, maybe we'll put it there. And then we'll hit a space. So it's it's tweaking. It's playing, right? This is what we're doing uh, with this wiki page. Some of this is going to be a limitation of the software. Uh, and really all we can do is the best that we can do. But I want you to see what a high quality wiki page can look like for your group. Now, this is going to... Uh, this page has some expectations that you don't have for your first assignment. All I'm looking for you to do for your first assignment is include some content um, and include a graphic, right, this kind of thing. As we move on, we'll talk more about making it look more professional. Don't worry about that right now. We're going to sort of build into that, all right? If you have any questions, let me know. Thanks.